coming to you from the Carol Blanton Ferris Law Firm Studios. It's the A1 Minute. Brought to you by Summer Classics Home of Richmond. Hey, it's Matt. Let's get this Tuesday started. The Library of Virginia is launching its first statewide tour in a new custom-built vehicle to bring its resources, staff expertise, and programming to all corners of Virginia. LVA On The Go is another way to connect with a wider audience that may not ever have the opportunity to visit Richmond and learn about the diverse collections and programs the library has to offer and the ongoing quest to uncover more of the enslaved living quarters at Westover Plantation is profiled by Bill Lohman at richmond.com. Archaeologists are still following up on the discoveries of a year ago of 19th century artifacts guided in part by historical maps. The search was first inspired by Westover owner Andrea Fisher Erda, who wanted to learn both sides of the plantation's history. Read more of Bill's feature at richmond.com. And lastly, a community garden in Richmond's Carter Jones Park received some TLC over the weekend. The small garden is encircled by a roadway through the park that shows remnants of chamomile flowers planted years ago, surrounded by persimmon trees, butterfly bushes, and mulberry. A handful of volunteers cleared overgrowth from the garden while also cleaning trash and brush from other areas of Carter Jones, also known as Fonicello Park. All right, that's it. Make sure you log on to richmond.com slash subscribe to get access to all the e-news. Bookmark richmond.com slash VVN to catch the latest videos and get interactive at RTD News and Virginia Video Network on social. I'll talk to you tomorrow for another edition of A1 Minute, brought to you by Summer Classics Home of Richmond, featuring livable luxury by Summer Classics and Gabby.